Yo, this is Shane717. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the McFarlane Toys Mortal Kombat 11 Shao Kahn action figure. On the back of the box, you can just see a, uh, it's like the action figure itself of Shao Kahn. Nothing really uh, special about the box. So far, I've been pretty happy with uh, McFarland Toys, the uh, quality of the uh, figures. They've really uh, stepped up their uh, game on these uh, action figures. The uh, back of the box you have just a uh, cardboard insert and you can slide that out and he includes a uh, stand with him. And he slides out in his little uh, slide out tray here. And the only accessory he has uh, that comes with him besides his uh, stand, if you want to include that, is his uh, hammer. big uh, mallet type hammer has the little um, dragon Mortal Kombat logo on it and here is Shao Kahn Got a lot of detail. This is a really cool figure. I think, I think out of all of these um, Mortal Kombat uh, figures, McFarlane Toys, I think he might be my favorite now. His eyes, uh, and if, I don't know if you can tell in here, but he has red eyes. The only uh, bummed out thing is I wish they could have uh, had him where he had a uh, maybe an alternative head or this uh, helmet you could remove it like the um, Storm Collectibles figure I don't have the uh, Storm Collectibles figure to compare them together but I think I like this the way this one looks better it's a little bit smaller but his uh, armor and everything is really detailed even the uh, spikes and stuff on his um, arms it's a really cool figure As far as his articulation goes, if you have any of the other Mortal Kombat figures, you'll pretty much have the same articulation. He has uh, double elbows and double knees. The only thing, I was uh, messing around with this figure uh, a minute ago and I noticed that you can't 
really get him into any kicking uh, poses. His legs are really limited with this um, armor on. But um, I don't think really he kicks a lot in the um, games I can remember. I may be wrong. Maybe you can comment uh, down there in, uh, in the comments and uh, let me know what you think of uh, his articulation as far as the legs go. But I think mostly in the games he uses that big hammer to hit people with. So you can put this in his hand. His um, hands or fingers are really, really tight there to try to get this thing in there, but uh, there it goes. And I have another um, McFarlane Toys Mortal Kombat figure to compare him with. I have the Tarkatan Beefcake, Baraka, which I really love that figure. All in all, this is a rad figure. If you could find him, I would uh, definitely get my hands on him. Uh, you can find him. I found this at my local Walmart. Uh, I'm sure you can start finding them uh, all around Walmart and your mainstream stores right now. That's it for this video. If you like my videos, be sure to like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And until next time, be safe and always out.